Well, the recent spike in egg prices has prompted a lot of Bay Area families to consider raising backyard chickens. That's a pretty, pretty big commitment, mm -hmm. though. I mean, you got to clean, you got to, it's, it's a thing. Clean. So it turns out it doesn't have to be that complicated. Sean Chitna shows us rent a chicken is now a thing. I don't think I want all of you guys out right now. Eric Strother has always loved chickens. He remembers raising them as a kid. I've always been a chicken geek. And he knows he's not alone. Many people want to have them at home or at least give it a try. A lot of people don't know where to start, and uh, this provides them a nice little starter kit uh, to, to try it out. When he heard that people were renting chickens on the East Coast and hadn't found anyone doing the same in the Bay Area, he saw an opportunity for a new business. Chickens seem to be very much at home in them. He created a tractor or a mobile chicken coop he can deliver with supplies. So customers can rent these backyard hens for one to three months. It's really taken off. Uh, people seem to really enjoy it. And I get calls from people all over the Bay Area um, and beyond. From his home in Sebastopol, Eric loads up his truck and travels to his next customer on weekends. You have to want to take on some new pets and watch out for them while they're with you. But of course, they help to put food on the table too. I had a customer uh, book a rental yesterday and she was like, it's all about the eggs. I got to have those eggs. He showed us some of the fresh eggs that had just been laid that morning. A daily delivery you can look forward to in the spring and summer when each hen usually lays one egg a day. They lay a few eggs a week in the fall and winter. While you won't save money with this method, you may have a more reliable supply of eggs while you're renting the hens. I love eggs. I've always loved eggs. Kelly Citron was Eric's first customer. For her, it was about the chicken and the egg. Kelly remembers having a chicken when she was seven years old, and now as an adult living in San Francisco, she wanted the experience again along with the fresh eggs. Having that connection with nature yet living in the city um, was a really great sort of balance. She plans to have hens in her backyard permanently soon, which is part of the goal for Eric, helping people to realize they can take on the responsibility of chickens. You can really get into it become a, a chicken geek. Converting more people to love these ladies as much as he does, one month at a time.